sparkly boobies. Just stroke myself all day. <laughs> va va voom. Sorry, I'm just currently dying. Sexy break free. Hello world and welcome back to another haul. Now I feel like that's a reoccurring thing and I apologise, slash I don't apologise, because we all love a good haul. Now I'm actually back in the background that I haven't filmed in for so long, and I haven't actually filmed with it on my new camera, so this is very strange for me, but basically, this is my sister's bedroom, and the reason I haven't filmed her in ages is because she finished uni, and she's been home. Now she's busy with work, so we'll see this slipping in and out a bit more often. Now I don't lie, you guys can't see my bottoms, but I'm wearing shorts and they're really going up my noona. So I'm just gonna take off my shorts, as you do. I've also got really cute princess pants on, yeah. I may be 19, but I still wear princess underwear. And I just showed the whole world my underwear. But anyway, let's get a wiggle on. So today we have got a mesh key haul. Now you can't really tell from this package that it's mesh key, but the logo is down there. And on the box, it says 99 problems, but my outfit ain't one. I feel like that sums up my life. I've got a lot of problems, but I've got a lot of clothes to make up for those problems. So we're all good on that front. But anyway, yes, mesh key is a brand that I've seen all over Instagram. And I've seen all these like sassy girls in these little fringed outfits. And I was like, I'm going to try and be a sassy gal. So that's exactly what we're going to do. And yeah, this video is not sponsored. But Meshki did send over these items. They are a gift. But you know me. I've got a big mouth. If I love something, I'm going to tell you. If I dislike something, I'm going to tell you. But hopefully, I'll like everything. Oh, and I also have a discount code for you all. Because, you know, sharing is caring. Sorry, mum's just asking what I want from Superdrug and I've run out of makeup wipes, so you know, priorities. I just texted my mum saying that I need denture tablets to clean my braces. I sleep at night with like an invisible brace, a retainer, that's a technical term, and I've run out of the, the little like tablets that they use for like old people teeth. That's what I use to clean them, in case you wanted to know. But this package has come all the way from Australia and it literally took like three days which is so impressive and there was no import fees which is equally as impressive don't want to commit that there isn't any because you could be that unlucky soul that does get import fees but I was very fortunate to not now I'm gonna need some scissors because this is robust I love how my scissors well and your scissors look like they're for a two-year-old there again that's probably close to my age Ooh. Well, I know we've got some fringing to come because I've opened the box and can you see there's like fringing sticking out. So we've got two boxes, it seems, of goodies. And I selected these pieces and then a lot of them were out of stock. So I selected other pieces and then some of them were in stock. So I generally have zero clue what we're about to unpackage. Oh, oh, my eyelash stuck together. But okay, two boxes. Definitely got some red stuff coming as well, I can tell, to match the lipstick. And then we've got some white fringing. But don't mind me, I'm now going to pause the video and take a thumbnail with the pretty boxes. See you when I'm back. When taking the thumbnail, I realised that um, my head looks like a giant watermelon with this hairdo. But we're going to pretend it's sleek, it's sexy, and we're going to open the goodies. Okay, I feel like I need to start with the white tassels. Just because I think that's what we all know mesh before. Where have my child side scissors gone? I do love a clothing brand that sends it in a box. Because I just think it makes it look so luxurious. Oh, okay, we've got some goodies packed in here. Also, I feel like it's kind of, because it's mesh key and it's got loads of M's on it. I'm like, it's kind of personalised to say Misha on it. Obviously it's not, but you know, the thought counts. Okay, so we've got a nice little parcel here. I feel like it's Christmas. Oh, oh, okay. <gasps> oh, look at this little red top. So this is in a size extra small and it's one of those tie front tops, but it's like a, is it a fake tie front? <gasps> I think it is. That's revolutionary. Oh, okay, so it's like that, 
and then you add the tie around the center, which I do appreciate because I love me a tie front top, but I am always scared that I'm gonna flash the world my, my areola. I'm not gonna get all biological and sciencey on you all, but I love the sleeves. It's got these little like floofy, very Aladdin sleeves, little zip at the back. So we're gonna go back to the old fashioned way of me trying on the item after in a separate clip, just because I can't really try on where I am right now. So let's go to the try on clip. First things first, I thought I'd show you this top without the tie detailing. Like you could actually still wear this. It's still really, really nice. But let's add in this little detail. I think this just makes it look a little bit more like cool, funky, holiday vibes. Slash, I do think you could wear this with a pair of high-waisted jeans and it would look quite how do I? I've never been very good at tying bows. And I think that's evidence. So this is the top. It's so beautiful. Such nice quality. I know they also had some red matching pants. Um, but the item that I've teamed it with is coming next. Now, next, this is what we are talking about. about. Here we have one of the little meshki skirts. This is so stunning it's such nice quality like oh my gosh that's so thick and it's literally just like a little white fringed skirt but i think this is so cool i feel like maybe was the top out of stock or it could be in the other box i guess we'll find out but no this is so nice and i got this in a size extra small so let's hope it's not too small because i do normally like my skirts a little bit bigger so i feel like misha you probably should have got the small yolo Okie dokie, here is the skirt. Now, I won't lie, it's very short short. Like, if you're not into short skirts, I wouldn't recommend, but it is sassy as hell. Now, it also does come up quite small. So, I currently haven't got it done up, but it will do up, but I just need somebody else to do it up on me. Like, it will close, like, easily, but you know when it's, like, on yourself, you can't get the right angle to attack the zip from. But I do love this skirt. I definitely need to get my hands on the matching top. But even, I think, with the black and the, black and the white, white and the red, it looks quite cute. And to be fair, I have so many white tops. I've got options. Okay. Can't say I recall what this is. Oh, yes, I can. Yes, I can. Okay, this is just one of those really good go-to summer pieces. And I need to, like, cinch it in. Because it's been all stretched out. And then you guys are going to literally think I'm holding up, like, a bed sheet. But, okay. Can I manage it? I can manage it. So it's a little, like, romper play suit. Is it a play suit? Yes, it definitely has a funny bit. Oh, but look how sweet that is. And it's got these little, like, pull bits at the front, at the centre. I thought it was going to be more sheer than this, so I thought I would a million and one percent need to wear a bikini underneath it, but I do reckon that a Primark nipple cover will save the day and I could genuinely wear this out, like dressy, as well as with a bikini. So that's winning at life. This is an extra small, but because it's got those like stretchy bands, I feel like it would fit a multitude of sizes. <laughs> I think I'm talking too much, so my throat's gone very dry. So I may have been fiddling around with this for about five minutes before I realised it's not supposed to be worn like that. So you could wear it like that, and it does look cute, but it looks cuter off the shoulder. I love this. This is one of those pieces that are just so timeless. They will never go out of trend. They are comfy. They are light. I don't actually have any nipple covers on right now and you cannot see anything so it really isn't very sheer and it's really nice because the front is a little bit shorter than the back so it's really slimming around the leg and then I mean just look at these sleeves and also you can like loosen and tighten this so like if you felt that a bit too restrictive you can pull the fabric so that more is covered but still have that that freedom to break free that's totally not a song, but let's continue on with this haul. Won't say I remember this. <coughs> Sorry, I'm just currently dying. I don't remember picking this, but I like it. So, let me just assemble the garment. This is like a do-it-yourself one. It's got a little strappage. That sounds wrong, strappage. So, here we go. This is a little play suit. It's a little, is it cream or white? I'd say that's cream, 
play suit and it's got this like buckle almost like a belt strap do you see how they're like adjustable so you can decide how you want them <gasps> this is so nice how did i not see this on the site or see it put it in my basket and not realize i put it in my basket i swear like when i'm online shopping my brain just like has a fart it has a full-on fart and it just forgets everything but this is so nice this is also an extra small oh and they do call it white but I do feel like it's a bit more cream than white. But I feel like the line is very difficult. Like, where's the line between cream and white? Well, let's hope my fake tan doesn't go all over this. But I'm sure we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Well, this is an unsurprising, an unsurprising, a surprising success. And I mean success surprising because I didn't actually know it was going to be in this haul. But I think this is so nice. This gives me major Shani Grammond, Grimmond, don't know how you pronounce her name, Australian YouTuber, she's insane. Um, this gives me major her vibes. This is the sort of thing that she would wear clubbing. Now, I don't go clubbing very often, talk like maybe once a year, but maybe this can be the outfit for when that does happen. I also think this could look really cute with like knee high boots but it's very warm right now, so I wouldn't suggest knee high boots. So maybe just sandals if you wanted to wear it in the day to make it a little bit more casual. But those details are so nice. This is so beautifully made, really nicely fit. It's not giving me camel toe, which is brilliant because no one wants to see my nunny. And yes. Ba ba boom, va va boom. I don't know what that noise was, but I do recall this item because it left such a a dent on my heart no because i've got it so it's given me joy let's go with that so this is a black silky maxi dress now i know right now holding this it's not showing it in all its glory but you just wait until the try on clip i haven't tried this on yet but i just know it's gonna be beautiful and if it isn't then i cry literally i wish i could be one of those people that like cry on demand Imagine, like, <laughs> it'd make quite good story times, wouldn't it? But no, I can't do that. I'm not very good at acting. Okay, so this has got like a massive split in the front. It's in this gorgeous black silky fabric. And then this like top bit is, I don't really know how to explain it, but I suppose we'll all see in the try on clip. And I think I also got this one in an extra small, which is apparently a size four. So yeah, these may be a bit tight. I'm like in between a four and a six. I'm a five, guys. I'm a five. I feel like Ross from Friends when he's like, I'm an eight! If anyone knows what I'm talking about in that moment, then we can be friends. If you don't, then sorry, we can't be friends. Misha Grimes, come Jessica Rabbit. Hello! Oh my gosh, this Meshki clothes actually makes me feel like a sexy woman. Sexy! Ever. And then I do that and then it completely kills the vibe. Oh, there's a, little, there's a little bit of booby there. But can we see what I meant about the shoulder? This piece confused me getting it on. I had to like pull it round. So be careful on the makeup front. But there's like a nice slit of skin. There's not like loads where it looks really bare. But there's just a nice amount. And then this slit is insane. The fabric. Oh my gosh, I could just stroke myself all day. It's so soft. I love this. There's the perfect amount of train, which I shall show you. Can we see? It's just like the perfect amount. I'm pretty sure I love every single piece in this haul. This is a problem, guys. Because I haven't sat here in so long, and like so much has changed since I've last filmed here, I'm getting loads of flashbacks. It's really quite emosh. I feel like the last video I filmed where I was sat here was probably when I was on about 40k, and we're now nearly at 100. What the hell? Oh, I've just found a note from Meshki. Oh wait, obviously I accidentally opened the wrong one first. This is so beautiful. Look at that little hardware. So it says, Misha, we cannot wait to see you in your new Meshki pieces. We hope you love them. Love, Meshki. Oh, and oh my gosh, I am so excited for this. Partly because it's coming in the most beautiful little bags, but this is a Meshki swimwear piece. Guys, I could I, I could actually cry of happiness right now. And I said I couldn't cry on demand. Are you... Chloe, the Scottish best friend, is going to actually die. And we are going to be fighting over wearing this 
in Ibiza. But Chloe, I love you. It's all mine. Guys. 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 I've got a fully diamante encrusted bikini top. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh, it is isn't a medium. Oh, I don't know if I accidentally put a medium in my basket because I definitely don't have a medium boobs. But it looks it looks okay. I think we'll be okay. It might just be a little bit more covered than I'm used to. But then maybe I could fit chicken fillets in it. <gasps> oh my gosh. I'm not going to lie to you all. I won't be going anywhere near water in this and I wouldn't recommend that you do either but it's one of those pieces that you wear for show not for swimming because who actually swims nowadays I couldn't tell you the last time I actually swam ladies and gentlemen I have found my favorite item and you know it's serious business when Misha wax out the chicken fillet okay guys get me to Ibiza right now I am ready, Ocean Beach, come at me. I'm gonna be the girl with the sparkly boobs and I love it. And it keeps my chicken fillets really secure as well. Like they're not going anywhere. And like I could probably even make this a bit tighter. And then I literally look like I have actual bosoms. These bottoms are for an item that's coming later. They're not actually a swimwear piece, but I just thought they kind of go with the bikini. So yes, this is hands down my favorite piece. Who would not want sparkly boobies? This is insane. I actually can't. And this is the back. You can like tie both of them to whatever length you want, which I think is perfect. <gasps> oh my gosh. And I'm really glad I got the medium as well because it means like that's what it looks like without the chicken fillet. It's not bad, but I feel like this sort of thing suits the chicken fillets. But I can go none or I can go chicken fillets. Maybe I wear them like this. And then, like, if I get hungry whilst I'm at Oceans, I can just be like, ah, Chloe, I'm just going to have a bit of a snack. Oh, I actually just got red lipstick all over that. Whoopsies, let's continue on with this haul. Oh, and then I do also have one of their other bikinis. Oh, my good sweet Jesus. Is that a top? A bottom? Is that... Woo! Guys, I actually thought this was the bottoms. I thought that was supposed to cover me from the rest of the world. Do not fret, that is the bikini top and that is probably the right size for my bosom. These do look like they come up quite small. I'm assuming they stretch when on the chest because I know I've got small boobs, but that's like child training size bra. Okay, and this is an extra small. Okay, okay, yes. I love this colour. It's like a greyish, stony, and then these are the bottoms. So I got the bottoms in an extra small as well, but they actually don't look too tiny, which is great because I don't want to flush everything. I'm loving these strings. They're very stretchy, so hopefully they won't go cutting into me. But can you see that it kind of looks like a nappy, and that's the vibe. It's kind of like diaper, but fashionable. So hopefully I won't look like I pooed my pants, but if I do, I suppose we can all have a bit of a laugh and a joke about it. Okay, people, here is the rather minuscule bikini, which actually fits my boobs so nicely it kind of makes me look like i have little boobies like little perk boobs and i mean my boobs are quite perk that's one of the joys of having no boobs is that your boobs are quite perk sorry my hair came undone but yeah these are the bottoms they're not as high-waisted as i thought which is probably not a bad thing you can obviously pull these strings however you see fit I would say that you do need to shave within an inch of your life because it's that fabric that shows every little sticky out bit. But anyway, I absolutely love it. This colour is beautiful. The quality is insane. I won't lie, it took me about 20 minutes to get it on because I couldn't think out thing now figure out all the strings here is the back excuse my pale bum my bum didn't get a fake tan and i've actually had this fake tan on now for like two weeks so it's probably like majorly a bit pale but we're going with it this bikini is insane i love it i want it in every color because i know they also do it in like a taupey nude which i think might have to get in my basket with of course my discount code we've got some white now 
Oh, what is oh, okay. They sent me a photo of this one and I thought that it was a top and trousers, but it's actually a play suit. No, a play suit? No, that's short. A jumpsuit. So again, it's got one of those tie fronts, but this one's actually a real tie front. But then let's say there's quite a lot of fabric there, which is brilliant. And then it's got these like splits on the leg now i won't lie when i show mum this jumpsuit she's gonna be like misha you have 10 other jumpsuits i'm gonna be like mum no white jumpsuit is the same i can tell you that now and this is absolutely beautiful i love it it's an extra small again but it doesn't look too tiny which is brilliant cannot wait to try this on let's hope it doesn't flash my knickers i'm definitely gonna have to change out the princess pants because no one wants to see my Belle, that sounds wrong. Sleeping Beauty, that still sounds wrong. Okay, let's continue onwards. Ta da! I feel like I'm the guy from. Why can't I think of his name? Oh, hi, ambulance! Leonardo DiCaprio. I feel like I'm part of um, Romeo and Juliet, but hopefully, I mean, I don't think anyone's gonna drink a potion because they think I'm dead. That's not gonna happen. Okay, back to the item. I love this. I like it a lot more than I thought I would. My only issue is, it is giving me a littlest bit of camel toe. I think if I wore like, a, I, mean, I, I won't lie to you all, I don't have any pants on right now. So I feel like that's probably accentuating the problem. But because of that, I think it actually kind of looks okay on my bum. So you can't really see it but I can feel it, it's that sort of thing. And then, I mean, just, it's so nice. Like, you would generally think this is two separate items, but it's one look together. And then it's just got, like, full-length pants with your legs slits, and I love it. It's beautiful. I think you can't go wrong with white. Like, it just looks so expensive. We've got another red piece, and oh my goodness. <gasps> this is so stunning i'm concerned that it may show bloat because it's that beautiful fabric that kind of shows all your sins and your gal's been sinning quite a bit recently but then it's like this it's almost like a slip dress but it's fitted and then at the bottom it has this like tie detail on one of the thighs that's so unique again i can't this but it's beautiful this is in a size extra small again and i do love meshki's logo like i think it's really cool <gasps> i love this oh my gosh these are going straight in my suitcase okay so i know my body shape too well i love this dress i think it's stunning but can we see that i just i don't have the shape for it like i know when i'm just not curvaceous enough for something and i do think Sadly, this is that dress. Like, I still think it looks nice, but I don't think it's necessarily, like, something that I would say, oh, my gosh, yes, Misha, you should wear that. It makes you look really nice and shapely because, it, I mean, it doesn't. I've got chicken fillets in just because without them, like, it's... It's just not my finest look. But I do love this detailing down here. It just goes... <laughs> It just goes down over the leg, and I love this, but I think my sister Anya may look nicer in this. So, Anya, you're welcome. Oh, okay, the sparkle is going everywhere. It's one of those items that, you know, it's really sparkly, but it literally, like, comes off on everything. Oh, it's not coming off on my hands, but it's coming off on my legs. I feel like maybe once you wear it once, and, like, the shimmer comes out, it'll be fine. Oh my goodness me, okay, I do remember this, but I didn't realise it was sparkly, I thought it was plain white. So it's one of those dresses that has like a cutout bit in the middle section, and then it goes down to a long skirt. There's no slit, oh my gosh, I'm literally covered in sparkles right now, but it's worth it. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. <gasps> this is a white piece. I feel like a lot of Meshki's clothes are white, red and black, which I do think are classic colours and somehow I have accidentally managed to dress in red, white and black. It's as though I knew, which I, I did know because I looked at the website, but I didn't put two and two together guys, we all know that. I feel like a mermaid. I literally feel like Ariel. Oh my gosh, this dress is stunning it fits like a dream this little band is kind of pulling out bits 
but I feel like that's kind of what it's just like and I would recommend some booby tape because this could literally go at any time but this is all oh, oh it's all twisted at the back oh whoopsies this is the struggle of having a YouTube channel just to yourself because you don't have the other person to come help you obviously I have Mama Grimes a lot but Mama Grimes isn't even in a house right now which is very strange but no this is Stunning. I kind of wish I didn't get the white because I'm going to a wedding at the end of the year and I would so wear this in the evening but if I wore this in the evening at a wedding I would look like I'm trying to dress like the bride which would be awful and it's a beautiful length. It's not very stretchy around the legs. This is going to be a struggle. Look. <gasps> I literally feel like a little like bride. If you were a bride you could actually wear this for like the evening do of your wedding. <gasps> this is Stunning. I just wish it didn't sparkle everywhere, but to be fair, the more glitter, the better. Was my nipple out? No, I think we're good. One final piece, which I'm kind of scared by. I won't... Come again? So we got some nice knickers, another pair of Bridget Joan knickers, but I do love a good pair of Bridget Joan knickers, because sometimes we want to be comfortable and i mean these are cool i would actually wear these almost like a bikini bottom and then to wear over the top because i didn't just get a piece of a pair of nude knickers is this jumpsuit now i think i'm gonna need to wear a little bralette underneath maybe even the sparkly one or just like a plain white one but it's a lace jumpsuit and this gives me such ibiza vibes i think these are so cool so you could either wear it with like the knickers and a bralette and make it eveningly or wear it with like a white bikini and then you've got the best of both worlds now peeps for a girl that's not into see-through mesh things i love this i'm gonna come up here so you can see the leg but I've just got the pants on with it and they're like a little bit flared but not too much. I could also wear them with sandals which is brilliant. I've kept on the little silver bralette but I do think that a little white one would work a bit better. Even what I would maybe do is get a full white piece underneath like a bodysuit because I do think that the gap in between the bralette and my stomach looks a little bit weird. But let me know what you think. This lace is stunning. It looks so classy <gasps> guys i'm just blown away by mesh key i just i don't even know what to think apart from it's all amazing <gasps> that is everything from this mesh key haul and i can i just spat on my own hand that was not what i was trying to tell you all but i can hand on heart say i am blown away blown away now i feel like earlier i said to you guys add a discount code but i forgot to tell you what it is alfie can you pipe down okay so you can get 15 percent off your order if you order something over the value of 50 australian dollars which is a lot less in english money because the exchange dog dog we good okay which is a lot less because of the exchange rate. I will put how much that is in English pounds that you need to spend to be able to then save 15% by... I think mum might be coming home and that's why he's barking because he can tell. And you need to just use the code Misha to get a cheeky little discount. Okay, so yeah, I am honestly so impressed. I think these are such beautiful, like, special occasion pieces. This does give me major, like, House of CB, um, what's the other one? Mistress Rocks vibes. That is totally what I'm getting. But they are incredibly unique. Like, who else does a diamond encrusted bikini top? Can mum come in the front door so Alfie can stop barking now? I'm just trying to do my outro. Alf, I'm trying to do my outro okay yes so i'm gonna link all the items down below i hope you guys have enjoyed this haul as you are watching this i am jetting off to the states i'm first going to be in orlando and at the pageant at the galaxy pageant then i'm going to disney for two days and then i'm off to miami so i've got the best 
three weeks lined up. Right now, I'm like a stressy mess because I'm trying to organize everything. I'm filming this on the Friday before I leave and I'm away all of this weekend and then we leave Monday. So it's a bit touch and go, haven't started packing, but I can promise you that you need to follow me on my Instagram at Misha underscore Grimes because you are gonna see probably each and every one of these pieces on my Instagram in Miami in photos. So I love you guys lots. I hope you have enjoyed this testing mesh key video. This bow is just, it's not doing me joys. I will link what I'm wearing down below. And yes, I love you guys lots. Thank you so much for all your love and support. Your comments recently have truly warmed my heart as they always do. But yes, make sure to subscribe because 100K could have some exciting things along the way. Yes. Okay, bye-bye. Love you lots. And I will see you all next time. Have a fabulous rest of the week.